Okay, welcome back. This is our last video for this um, morning. Well, this morning for me. And it's pretty simple. We're going to look at um, another right minus left problem. Okay? So once again, the blue line is always to the right of the green parabola. So we're going to integrate, but we have to integrate in terms of y. So one of the things I noticed is that this is in terms of y. x is equal to here. But here, this is not in terms of y. So I have to solve for x. So to solve for x, I'm going to subtract 4 from both sides. And I get negative x is equal to y minus 4. And then divide by negative 1. I get x is equal to um, negative y plus 4. Okay? Now, this graph shows me my points of intersection, but let's just try them out for ourselves. Let's solve it. So if I wanted to know my points of intersection, I would have to set this x value equal to this x value. So I get y minus 2 squared is equal to negative y plus 4. Multiplying this out, I get y squared minus 4y plus 4 equals negative y plus 4. Um, moving this over to the other side, I get y squared minus 3y equals 0. Factoring. So I get y is 0 and y is 3. Does that seem right? So here I got um, this is 2. This is 2. Oh, I'm looking at y value, sorry. This is 2 and this is 4. So this is 3, this is 2, that's 3, and that's 4. Um, no, I'm sorry. I keep looking at x values. This point is 4, 0. Remember, I'm looking at y values, though. And this point is 2, uh, let's see, 2, this is 1, 3. But I am looking at my y values. So I'm integrating my y values. So once again, I do right minus left. So this is 4 minus x minus y minus 2 squared. And I'm integrating from 0 to 3. Okay? And once again, everything's in terms of y because it's right minus left. It's right minus left. Again, yeah, we could break this up and integrate. It's just too much trouble. It's easier to just do it this way. So integrating this, I get um, 4, and I have to remember that I put that in wrong. Um, this should be x is negative y plus 4. I'm glad I caught that. I'm sure at home you had already caught that. This should be negative y plus 4. I looked at the wrong thing. There we go. All right, so integrating this, I get negative y squared over 2 plus 4y minus, integrating this using new substitution, this will give me y minus 2 cubed over 3. And then I would integrate that from 0 to 3. So that's negative 9 half plus 12 minus 3 minus 2 is 1, so minus a third, and that's our answer, okay? So that is the last video. Uh, thank you for watching, and I look forward to doing this with you on Monday. Um, you want to complete, uh, as practice, you want to go ahead and complete all the problems on pages 10, 9, and 8. Any problems that we have not done, go ahead and do pages 8, 9, and 10, and then we'll talk about them on Monday. I'll see you at school.